One two one two Dre Baldwin DreAllDay.com. I'm gonna get into trash talking. This is a video that I didn't even think I needed to make, but obviously I see a lot of players, I guess younger players, up and coming players. You come up in different playing environments, you don't know how to deal with trash talking or if it's good or bad for you or whatever. Now me personally, my background, I come from playing ball in the street. Like I grew up playing ball at a playground on concrete. That's where I played my games. That's where I practiced. I was there hours and hours every day. And, you know, when you play ball in the hood, in the street, there's plenty of trash talking. Trash talking is just part of the game. You trash talking when you're playing one-on-one, -on -one, you're playing rough house, you're playing full court. We trash talk before the game, after the game. You see a guy you was playing against, you see him in the mall, you trash talking. That's just how we come up. But I know a lot of you don't come from that same background or same environment. So then when you run into a player who comes from a background like mine, they start to trash talking. Sometimes it can rattle you. You don't know how to handle it. If you should do something, if you should react or respond, you don't know. Here's the main thing about trash talking. For all you players that ask, is I get players asking me, like, yo, what do you do when a player, another player is trash talking you or somebody in the crowd is talking shit to you? What do you do? Listen. Trash talking is just words that people are saying. And I'm sure all you have heard the cliche, sticks and stones will break my bones, but words will never hurt me. So if somebody's saying something to you, you don't have to do anything. You don't have to respond. You don't have to say something back to them. You don't have to play any harder or softer. You don't have to do anything. Somebody just said something. Nothing that nobody says controls you. Uh, you're not a, a slave. So anything that somebody says... You have a choice to respond to it or to ignore it. That's your choice. So if you choose to respond, that's fine. If you choose not to, that's also fine. So somebody trash talking you does not mean you have to do anything. So if that's your question, that's your answer. You don't have to do anything when somebody's trash talking you. Then some people ask, is trash talking good? Should I talk trash? Listen, you got to ask if you need to be talking trash in the game, you don't need to be talking trash in the game. You don't need to be saying a damn thing. You just need to play. All right, it's one of those things, like when somebody asks me like certain moves or techniques, they're like, yo, should I use this in a game? And my answer is like, if you got to ask, then you shouldn't be doing it. All right, trash talking is one of them things. If you asking or you thinking about it, you need some advice, don't do it. Just say nothing, just play. Me personally, when I played, coming up, I used to talk a lot of trash. Like I would just start trash talking out of nowhere. I'd just say something to somebody. They wouldn't even be talking. I'd just start talking to them for no reason. And usually... What you'll hear about trash talking most of the time is not that I really think that you are whatever I'm saying about you. Most of the time is just to get myself going. Because once I start talking trash to a player out of nowhere, now everything that I'm saying, I got to back it up. So that causes me to raise my game. Because that's how it works for me. And that's how it might work for some other players. That might not necessarily be what works for you. So you got to figure out what works for you. Nobody can tell you what you need to be doing. You know what your psyche is. You know what your mental makeup is you know what works for you is if talking gets you going gets you playing better at a higher level then that's what works for you if it's not something that works for you then you don't have to say anything now me nowadays personally even if somebody i don't really trash talk as much as i used to i don't really say nothing when i'm playing the games i found because i've done it i experiment kind of sometimes i'll go through a game and i won't say nothing like i'll play against a team where everybody on their team is talking like they might be saying stuff directed to me or they might be talking to the refs or talking up them talking themselves up all game and I won't say nothing. I won't respond to nothing that they say and I see how I play, how I feel mentally while the game's going on, and then I'll go to a game where I start saying stuff to people. I'll respond to things and go back and forth and see how I am there and compare the two and I find that I play better if I don't say anything. So nowadays when I play, even if somebody says something to me first, usually I won't even say nothing back. Or I'll wait to the end of the game after I didn't kick their ass and we won, then I'll say something to them and, and it'll just be over. There ain't nothing they can say once the game's over. So me personally, like I said, I just kind of tone down my talk and I don't really do it that much anymore. It's a waste of energy for me. But like I said, every player is different. You got to figure out what works for you. You can't necessarily do what works for me. So that's it. The issue of trash talking, now you know. To recap, somebody says something to you, you ain't got to do nothing. It's just words. Just keep playing. If you're not sure if you should be trash talking or not, you shouldn't. <laughs> and that's that. Work on your game. Dre all day. Dot com. Block Rashi from Chicago. Work on your game.